alongside Ray Furrow, I'm James Sabalski. Welcome back, everyone. Three on three action just moments away here. A sight every hockey fan can appreciate. It's a clean sheet of ice, and we are about to get underway. The Canucks take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Quick shot from out of nowhere. What a stop. his own face off and he wins the draw hammers it on net and he comes up with the save big time play right there handles the puck Chilliwack's got control of it now from their own end there's the whistle offside is the call stopping the play One possession. With possession along the wall. Jocelyn for the puck and it's knocked away. Can't get a hold of that pass. And now it's grabbed by Ben. Ben swooping in on the attack. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Another stop by the goaltender. Oh, he's walked right in. A couple of stops in a row there. And the goalie leaves his crease to play the puck. Edmonton's gained possession along the boards. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. And that's picked off in front. Trying to shake off the defender. Denies him. Oh, excellent stop by the goaltender. He read that perfectly. Chilliwack's got a hold of it along the wall. Quick pass to Murphy. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Puts it on net. Comes up with the stop. Slides the pass over to Ben. Here's a short pass to Smith. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Here's a chance. Edmonton's got the puck inside the defensive zone. And that's broken up. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Here's an offensive chance. Moves it around along the half wall. Big hit. The Wolverines have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Look out, here's a 2 on 0 oh. Scores! Wow, what a goal! Nice hands, great finish. Little short break and it's in the net. Some guys like to shoot, some guys like to deep. You can shoot the puck like that on a breakaway. I'd pick that as option A. Edmonton's got the game's first goal just past the midway mark of the first. What's the mindset now here? They were just talking on the bench. Let's go get another. I like it. You're up one. Be aggressive. Go push the other team against the wall. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. one nothing is where we sit at this point. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Murphy's got it across the line. Along the half wall with the puck. From the point, they take control of it. Into the corner. Move to the middle. Moves up near the blue line and looks to set up at the point. Angles it over to Smith. Takes the feed. Stopped by the goaltender. Scores! On the rebound, he pops it! Uh, goalie burps up this rebound here. It comes right back into the shooting area, and the rebound is put away. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. McPherson's got the puck and forces a huge turnover here with the steal. I don't mind the attempt here. They're behind in the game. You got to take a chance once in a while with the puck. There's the whistle icing the call.
Getting into the later stages of this period, the Wolverines have all the momentum right now, leading by two. Pens won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. And that one's broken up. Dowling's got it in the defensive end. Sends the pass down low. Well, that'll do it for period number one and a chance for both teams to kind of get a refresh here. The rink barely tilted to one side after the first 20. They lead it 2-0. still to play. We're looking forward to it. Hopefully you are too. Welcome back, everyone. He's Ray. I'm James. Second period set to go. Here we go. Middle frame now underway as the puck drops. Well, this one underway. Ray, give us an update of what your assessment is to this point. Chilliwack's puck possession was pretty poor in that first period. They turned it over way too often. Pretty lucky the score's close. And that one's broken up. He might have a step here. He's clear. He scores! He deeks the goaltender out after he blows the pack away and pulls away on the breakaway. Edmonton's been all over them here in this second period. Just look at the score, and they have dominated in the shot clock, too. Ben stick handling in his own zone. Solid hit on that play. Nice defensive robbery on that. A little dipsy doodle, and he loses possession of the puck. Takes it across the blue line. Jostling for the puck, and he loses control. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Gets in front of it. Picked off in the open ice. It's a three-on-one. Great hit on the play. The Wolverines have it against the wall. Moves the puck along the half wall. Here's a blast, and a great scene. Edmonton's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. And that one's broken up. The Canucks take possession in the defensive end. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. Trying to get it out of danger. And that's picked up by a teammate instead. Intercepted. Takes the pass. And that's picked off. Puck scooped up by Ben. It's a two-on-one. Centering pass. Scores. Quick blast. No chance. The Wolverines have been the busier team offensively tonight. They've dominated in their own end, haven't given up anything, and scored almost at will at the other. Great hand-eye coordination as he gets the puck back. Denied by the goaltender. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. Chilliwack's got the puck along the wall. Carries it in. Shot! Oh, what a stop! Outstanding save and a huge opportunity! Why a goalie can never relax. He makes one stop, now he's got to be sharp to make another. Chilliwack's got it from behind the net. Centered out in front! Tries to feed it over, trying to gain a step. He's in all alone. Stones him on the breakaway. The Canucks gain possession in their own end. Great defensive play to come up with the puck. Edmonton's really stomping all over these guys. A lot of it is that when they don't have the puck, they get it back so fast. And that's blocked. 
And look at that sip down oh. the ice to wave off icing. You've got to get past the hash marks to get it waved off. He does a good job. Second frame almost done. Well inside a minute now. Offside is the call. But we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. Edmonton's been an impressive club to watch tonight, especially offensively, as they lead big here late in the second. Puck has dropped, and we are back underway. Slides it diagonally to Smith. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Hard sounds bringing the second period to an end. What a demolition we've seen through the first two periods. It's 4-0. Welcome back, everyone. He's Ray. I'm James, and we are ready to kickstart this third period. It's been a total mismatch here as we get underway for the third. Let's see if anything changes. 40 minutes into this one here. Razor, how do you see things? Edmonton's focus now is just locked down this game. Comfortable lead. They've been terrific through 40 minutes. Don't give it away now. Receives the pass. Chilliwack's got the puck along the boards. They fight for it along the boards. Kicked up ahead to his teammate who skates away. Pokes the puck away. Takes the return feed. Poked away from danger. Takes the feed. Sent into the opposite side. Chilliwack's got a hold of it along the wall. Carries it across the line. Sends the pass over. Here's a chance on the doorstep. Official blows the whistle, and you know what that means. It's a penalty shot. The hockey equivalent of the showdown at high noon is set to go. Makes the stop under pressure. Oh, and another look at that. Oh, yeah, here it is. Oh, yeah, good work, guys. Good work, Brannigan. Getting this thing right. What a stop by the goaltender. Edmonton's showing no signs of slowing down here in this third period up big time. Dowling's taking it from his own end. Sends a pass over. Right up front. Can't connect. What a steal in his own end. Takes control of the puck. King's on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. The Wolverines have shown no signs of slowing down here in this third period up big. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. On the attack along the boards. Centering pass in front. Stopped by the goaltender. Still lots of time left here in this frame. It's 4-0. This has been a one-sided affair right from the get-go. Puck picked up by Murphy. Instead of covering up, he feeds it along. Edmonton's got a hold of it against the wall. Here's a stretch pass to Smith. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Taken by Ben. Quick feed to Smith. The Canucks gain control of the puck against the wall. Over the line they come. Lugs the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. The backhander, he scores! Perfect timing. Well, they've been trying to get through, break through on this goaltender who's been running a shadow. Finally, they get one. I actually thought he was going to do it, James. He played so well. I thought the shutout was there for the taking. He just couldn't quite close the deal. Well past the midway mark of this period. Chilliwack's got to try to find a way to get some offense going. Still trailing by three goals. Wrists one, and that goes off a player in front. Comes up with a stop. Nice pass. Slides it across. Scores! Oh, that was a beauty! Bang, bang. Two goals and right around a minute 40. We are not done yet here. 
Buckle up. Don't even think about leaving your seat. Yeah, they got their track shoes on now. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. Sends it across. Big time defensive play. Here, he scores! Two goals on the night for him. They've really been effective forechecking. A couple of breaks, and now he's got two. The Wolverines are in cruise control here, but they're showing no signs of letting up. No, the lesson began about two hours ago, and it's not class out yet. An attempt to clear the puck from deep inside his own end. Icing is called, stopping the play dead. Here in the later stages of this period, Edmonton's really put the squeeze on here now, up by three. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Grabbed along the boards by Murphy. Here they come on the attack. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Edmonton's gained possession along the boards. Nearing the final 60 seconds in this one. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. Oh, he looks like he's banged up there. He's going to try and finish the shift, but he's pretty clearly not at 100%. Slides the puck over. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. The Canucks have it from their own end. Moves it up. They've got the defense outnumbered. Snaps one from the slot. Blocker saved by the goalkeeper. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close, he takes away any room. And we've got a two-on-one. Chilliwack's got the puck in their own end. To his teammate. Right out front. And that one stopped. Chilliwack's got the puck along the wall. Moves the puck. And there's the final horn, putting a bow on this one here this evening. Well, oh, they'll look at it and say, hey, we controlled play at certain points. We had a better face-off percentage, but just not enough. Thanks for joining us tonight. everyone he's Ray Ferraro I'm James Sabalski we've got ourselves a clean sheet of ice here for this EA SHL three on three showdown
Two teams hungry for two points, and we are ready to drop the puck. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. This has been one we've been waiting for for a while, and it's time to finally see what the payoff is all about. Handles the pass from his goalie. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Nice pass. On the one-timer. Stops from cold. Saskatoon's got a hold of the puck. Hangs onto the puck. Picked off in the open ice. Here they are on the attack. Dowling's got it against the boards. Sends the pass over. Let's the wrister go. Can't connect. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. With the blast. And that's blocked as he gets down low. Saskatoon's gained possession along the boards. Murphy's got it across the line. Great defensive play to come up with the puck. One-on-one -on -one with the goaltender. Stays with it for the save. I thought the player really showed a nice deep, but the goalie has great patience, doesn't overcommit, and makes the save. Look out, a two-on-one. Quick pass across to Heatley. Here's a blast. Oh, comes up with a stop. Along the half wall with the puck. Huge steal in his own end. Now he takes it over the line. Set it out in front. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. Moves the puck along the half wall. Through center along the wing. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Trying to gain a step. He's in the clear. He scores! What a beautiful play! It's really kind of cool to think about how many decisions you have in about two and a half seconds. He's on the breakaway. Now he looks where the goalie's standing, whether the goalie's backing up, whether he's going faster than the goaltender, and he laid the deke on, and he doesn't miss. Murphy's lugging the puck. What a steal in his own end. It's like he had his eyes closed and he was trying to hold play something just to try and help them get back in the game. Tosses it on to Heatley. Handles the puck. He scores! Now you got to keep clawing back. Trailing in the game, they get the equalizer. Oh, he could really shoot the puck and he had enough time to tee that one up. He blows it right past the goaltender from the point. Well past the midway mark of this period. It's all tied up. Chilliwack's got the puck against the half wall. Here's a blast and puts it anywhere but the way he wanted it to go. Heads deep inside the offensive zone. Moves it around along the half wall. Makes the save. The Canucks play it along the boards. On the doorstep, and that's blocked. Here's the chance to set up now. Blocker saved by the goalkeeper. Parker's moving the puck through his own zone. And that one's stolen at center ice. Sends it to the opposite corner. First period almost in the books here, nearing the final 60 seconds. Sends it over. Shuts him down. In the final moments of this period, the next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. Dowling's taking it from his own end. Pass right back. A howitzer, and he stands tall in goal. As the first period comes to an end, this one's still a dead heat. 1-1 is where we sit. Welcome back, everyone. He's Ray. I'm James. Second period set to go. And we are underway, still tied up here in the second. Well, we've got over 20 minutes played thus far. Ray, how have you seen things? Saskatoon's focus has to be getting more pucks to the net. They really didn't do much in that first period. 
still plenty of time left in this frame. We are all tied up in this one. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Picks up the puck in his own end. Takes the feed. McPherson's got the puck. Pass right in front. He scores! Well, they break the tie here, James. This game had been hotly contested since it's been level. They now have found a way to jump into the lead. Chilliwack's got the lead on the scoreboard. A big reason of that has been the amount of pucks that they've been putting on net. Looking to make something happen along the boards. And makes the save. I like how he was able to follow the puck. Good save in close. And some good footwork to kick it away. Solid hit on that play. He might have a step here. He's in all alone. What a save on the play. And the puck escapes the zone and they'll be forced to tag up. Slides the puck near the front of the net. Scores! That's back to back ring. Well, the game has changed. Those two goals here really have changed the outlook. Chilliwack's now up by a pair. Still lots of time to go, but they've been good tonight. There's nothing to complain about. Their coaches look like they're pretty satisfied, but this is when you push harder, try and get the third goal and make this thing out of reach. Still lots of time left here in this frame. Chilliwack's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Here he is in front. Swing and a miss. Puck lands back onto a stick. And he'll get a chance with a penalty shot. And the moment of truth has arrived. Big opportunity here. Comes up with a huge stop. He was right on the move there. James, he was in great position there. He's not fooled at all, and he shuts it down. The Canucks are checking all the boxes tonight. More shots, more goals, and they lead in the second. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Gets in front of it. Chilliwack's done a nice job of generating pucks on net, and as a result, they lead here in the second. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. Straight up the middle. Here they come. Throws it in. Saskatoon's got a hold of it against the wall. The official signals penalty shot. Here we go. Goaltender takes a deep breath. And here we go. Makes the stop under pressure. Man, he read the shooter like a children's book. No problem. The Canucks have been the better team, leading in the shot department, and they lead it on the scoreboard. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Saskatoon's got a hold of it along the wall. Stopped by the goaltender. And now it's grabbed by Heatley. And there it is, penalty shot the call. Heatley's ready to go one-on-one -on -one with the goalie. And he misses the mark. Unfortunately, it's on a penalty shot. Otherwise, James, he could just keep the forecheck going. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. It's a two-goal lead we're looking at with the score 3-1. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. And that one's turned away. That's moved up ahead. That's a solid check on the play. Keeps hold of the puck. Chilliwax got possession here in the offensive zone. From his own end, he picks up the puck. Great balance as he scoops it back up. They've got the defense outnumbered. Chilliwax got the puck. Saskatoon's got possession at center. Takes the feet all alone. And makes the routine save. Moves it to Heatley. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. Here in the later stages of this period, crowd's been into this one right from the get-go. It's 3-1. Grabs the puck at center. Comes 
comes up with the steal. Strong defensive effort. The Canucks get a hold of the puck in their own end. Here they come, three of them. And that one's broken up by a great... He's got a little jump. He's in. Oh, what a save. There's the whistle icing the call. as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Loose puck battle along the boards. Just slide to the net. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Wicked save by the goaltender to get a pat on that. And there's the wrap-up cue for period number two. 40 minutes in the books. It's a 3-1 hockey game. And we are just moments away from the start of the third period. Moment of truth for one team. Here we go. Third period is underway. Ray Ferraro is between the... He scores! Three goals. The hat trick's in the bag. Here come the hat. What a great feeling as this place is jumping. Chilliwack's all too aware there's no mercy rule in hockey. They continue to apply the pressure. No, they're laying a beating on these guys now. It may be time to lay back just a bit. Here's a chance right out in front. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. He's got a step. Big stop. He really tried to sell the deep, but a well put score!
Well, a little more buzz in the barn tonight as the champs are in the building. Hi, everyone. Alongside Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Welcome back to the EASHL. Just moments away from puck drop, both teams seem ready to go. Puck is dropped and we are underway. This has been one we've been waiting for for a while and it's time to finally see what the payoff is all about. Takes a bump and loses control of the puck. Chilliwack's got the puck here in the open ice. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. And that's denied by the goaltender. Kong's got the puck now here inside his own defensive zone. Play whistle dead because of an offside. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. Nice pass. Along the half wall with the puck. He's off. Big stop. Takes it in front. And that's picked off. It's a straight up race for the puck. Icing is called, stopping the play dead. Center's jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Moves it to McDavid. McDavid's going to play the puck behind the cage. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Tries to feed it over to Murphy. Takes it across the blue line. Slides the puck to McDavid. It's a two-on-one. And he scores! What a shot! tape and into the net so quickly the goalie can't get closed up and make the save McDavid's won the draw here in the neutral zone on the attack along the boards skates in behind the cage into the corner the Canucks have a hold of it in the defensive zone Drives it to the front of the net. Gets in front of it. He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go for the puck. Moves behind the net. Feeds it down low. Moves the puck along the half wall. Gets that puck back on a stick. With the steal. Chilliwack's got it now. Puck scooped up by Murphy. Takes a shot. And he comes up with it. With all kinds of traffic, he grabs the puck here inside his own end. Hangs onto the puck. Moves the puck. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Here's a short pass to McDavid. He scores! I believe a colleague of ours likes to call those back-to-back. -back. Yeah, the coaches want you to stay aggressive after you score. They do that, and they're able to put another one up on the board. Puck is dropped and play resumes. The Goats pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. The Canucks look to start the transition game. Trying to shake the defender. Puck grabbed by McDavid. Chilliwack's grabbed a hold of the puck. Works it across to Murphy. Huge steal in his own end. Pass stolen in the open ice. Handles the puck. And there it is. Penalty shot the call. Dowling's ready for the penalty shot. Makes the stop under pressure. Here in the late goings of the period, Vancouver's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. 
they come on the attack. Here's a pace scores. I thought they were going to run out of time here, James. This is a terrific time to strike. Now you carry over the intermission. You come out for the next period feeling really good about yourself. here in the neutral zone and we are back underway and with the sound of the horn that means the conclusion of period number one i wonder if they'll have to check to see if this ice was tilted because we've got a three nothing one-sided score here through the first period of play still to play. We're looking forward to it. Hopefully you are too. just moments away from the start of period number two. A one-sided affair after the first 20 minutes. Here we go for period number two. One period already in the books. Ray, how have you seen this thing? Chilliwack's probably in a spot that they deserve to be in. They haven't had the puck very much. Of course they're going to be chasing the game. Passes right to the front. And he totally whiffs on that one. McPherson's got it on the offensive end. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Quick feed to Murphy and makes the save. Sends it over to McDavid. The Canucks get a hold of it. Slides the puck across to McDavid. Right on the doorstep. Nice save by the goaltender to get a pad on that. Chilliwack's ready to go on the attack. Vancouver's got the puck. He's in all alone. Scores! Goal! Well, this is a great reaction, James. He doesn't have much time to finish it off. He makes a perfect shot. Once he pulls away from everybody here, it's him and the goaltender. He freezes him, goes to the backhand, and puts it away. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. With possession along the wall. McDavid's able to take that quick pass. He's already got a couple of goals. He's looking for a third. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Hammers a shot, and that goes off a player in front. Slides the puck over. Through the offensive zone and behind the net now. With the steal. The Goats have it against the wall. And that pass is intercepted. Sends a pass over. They've got numbers. And he'll go to center ice for the penalty shot. Here's his chance, one-on-one -on -one with the goalie. He scores! Nice move. He sold that move so well. The goaltender is right out of position. He finishes the deke off and puts it in the net. More than half the frame has been played here. The Canucks have a deep hole to dig themselves out of trailing by three. Quick pass across to Murphy. Stopped by the goaltender. Moves it on over to Petrangelo. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Moves the puck behind the net. Chilliwack's got a hold of it along the wall. 
Takes a hit, he goes down to the up. Breakaway! Well, he scores! He completes the hat trick! And here come the doors opening up. They come out to clean up the hats that are going to be tossed onto the ice. Three times he's been able to score tonight. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Vancouver's got control of it now from their own end. Carries it in. A chance in front! And there's the save. Smothered that in close chance. And that slides right out to center ice. Taken by McDavid. McDavid's lugging the puck. Slides the puck down low. He scores! Three goals. The hat is in the bag. Here come the hat. What a great feeling as this place is jumping. Late goings of this period. The Goats have made this a thrashing with their latest goal. And he gets the puck right back. Slides the cross ice pass. Carries it across the line. Here they are on the attack. Manages to hang on. Vancouver's got the puck along the wall. Petrangelo's going to play it against the half wall. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. One-time shot. Denies him with a save. Here's a shot. Being stopped by the keeper. Dead center. Excellent save. Comes up with a steal. And that'll do it for period number two. And we are just moments away from the start of the third period. Well, this has been an absolute blowout through the first two periods as we get underway here in the third. Ray, with two periods in the books, what are your thoughts on the game to this point? Vancouver's focus now is... And it's in! He scores! Ah, uh, the release beats the goalie here. But there's a good break, too, as the puck hits the post. It goes in. Vancouver's having a lot of fun out there tonight, but Ray, I can imagine it's a different story on the other side of the bench. Yeah, half the guys out here are having fun. The other half, this game can't end quick enough. Gets it back. Looking to make something happen along the boards. What a steal in his own end. Here's a chance, a two-on-one. Great pad save. Slides it over with pace to Petrangelo. Murphy's got it in the defensive end. He's got a little jump. He's in. Here's an opportunity in front of the net. Right in front of the net. And he scores. The Canucks have a long way to go still here in the third. I guess you get your scores out there and you try and keep climbing out of a hole, but it's not very pretty right now. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Scored by number five. Beats the puck to Petrangelo. And that's intercepted. And that one's picked off in the neutral zone. Petrangelo stick handling in his own zone. Receives the pass. Chilliwack's got the puck along the boards. Over the line they come. Shot comes up with the stop. The Canucks gain possession in their own end. Here's an odd man rush. Beautiful cross-ice feed inside the zone. 
Moves it around along the half wall. Moves close to the point. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Takes the pass. Denied by the goaltender. Vancouver's offense has been the story tonight, leading big time here in this third period. While the centers are jammed up, nice job by the winger to steal the puck. And we've got a two-on-one. He scores! You talk about memorable nights. This has to be right up there. Man, it's like he's in practice. Every time he shoots the puck, it ends up in the back of the net. What a game for him. Vancouver's goal-scoring abilities have been on full display so far this evening and here in the third. Really impressive display. They've moved the puck well, skated, really forechecked. Well, there's really nothing they haven't done tonight. The Goat scoop it up along the boards. Petrangelo's moving the puck through his own zone. Slides it up to McDavid. And that one's picked off. Flips it up the net, and he makes the save. Wrist shot from the slot. Oh, and another big stop. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. Denies him on the play. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. And that one's turned away. Another stop by the goaltender. Oh, he followed the puck really well there. A couple of good stops. Look out, a two-on-one. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. And that one's stopped. Slide, and that clangs off the iron. This has been a heck of a shift for them. They've got them hemmed into the offensive zone. Now they can carry the puck around as the defenders are just going to play. And he'll go one-on-one -on -one with the goaltender with a penalty shot. He takes a deep breath at center ice. It's go time here. Puts it in and converts with the penalty shot. At this point, James, I don't think they've got anything to lose. They pull the goalie, right? They're trying to score. They chase around, and finally they get a chance, and the puck goes in the net. Here in the late goings of the period. This neutral zone faceoff set to go, and we are back underway. And they'll be forced to regroup after the puck bounces out of the offensive zone. King scooped up the puck now here inside his own zone. Exploring options from behind his own net. Slides it over to Petrangelo. A howitzer just wide. They say it's a game of inches, James. If that puck is a couple of inches to the side, that hits the post and goes in. Vancouver's got the puck in their own end. It's a two-on-one. Oh, what a stop by the goaltender. Lockhart's right on top of that chance. Great A spot, great A save. Again, the denial by the goaltender. Vancouver's offense has not been a problem tonight. They put a lot of shots on net and lead a big time late in this third period. Center's jammed up and the winger grabs the puck. Puts the puck on net and a great save. Feeds it up ahead. Jabs the puck away. Slides it diagonally. Here's a chance, a 2 on 0 Big stop. Oh, outstanding stop. He reads in nicely on the shooter who tried to fake him out of position. No dice. Scores! This is getting insane. It is crazy how often the puck tonight seems to end up on his stick. And then when it's on his stick, it ends up in the net next. What a game. start to finish you got a feel for the losing goaltender he had to
Well, as we line up here at center for this EASHL three-on-three -three showdown, he's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabalski. Really excited for this one. lined up in the middle we are ready to get things underway the Canucks take possession here on the opening draw and we are underway there's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside yeah. Dowling's won it here's an odd man rush absolutely levels them District fires across the blue line. And a great heads-up defensive play here. Kings on top of the puck, and that'll stop the play. Pretty conservative play here, James, as he covers it up to kill the play. Chilliwack's won the faceoff. Heads deep inside the offensive zone. And he makes the save. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Just wide! And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Back underway and they take possession here inside the offensive zone. And that one's turned away! Start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. With the stop. Kilowak's got a hold of it against the wall. Save made by the goalie. He's right on it. Two consecutive saves. Tough ones at that. Stopped by the goaltender. He's on it. Good chance, but he's able to glove that shot. Good heads up. He might have a step here. Pass it across. Gain possession along the boards. Takes it across the blue line. Snaps it on net. Makes the save. Dead center. Excellent save. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. And sends it just out of reach. Edmonton's looking to break out of their own end. Over the line they come. Unloads one. Oh, what a glove save. Setters jammed up, and the winger grabs the puck. Denied by the goaltender. Great defensive effort with the strip. District 5's got the puck along the wall. Blocked in traffic. Takes a hit. He goes down to the ice and coughs up the puck. Rocks him on the play. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Takes it at center. Quick shot, just wide of the net. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Stopped by the goaltender. 
Really good positioning as he makes the stop from in tight. Gobbles that puck up with his chest. Kings want it in their own end. Tommy Hawk's got the puck in his own zone. And the officials waving off icing here. Here he is in front. Big hit. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Slides the puck over. Edmonton's got the puck in the defensive end. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. Stopping the play. Puck is dropped. And play resumes. There's the whistle. Offside is the call. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. Here's a chance. And that's taken by the defense. Puck lands back onto a stick. Handles the puck at the point. Hammers it. Phenomenal save with the glove to knock it away. Let's it go! Big time stop there! And that's all she wrote for period number one as we are still scoreless after the first 20. Clean sheet of ice, period two is set to go. No goals yet through the first 20 minutes. Let's see if this changes here in period number two as we get underway. Ray, what's your assessment of the game to this point? Chilliwack talked about getting pucks to the net. They certainly did that in that first period. They just haven't found a way to crack the ice. Scoops up the puck now. Receives the pass. Sends it across. Here's the call. Penalty shot on the way. Kong's ready for the penalty shot. Huge stop right there. Shuts it down. Take that stuff away from here. Only two guys moving on the ice. One of them makes the shot, but the goaltender comes up large. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. They've got the defense outnumbered. Shot and makes the save. The frozen biscuits dropped and we are back underway here. And that one's picked off. Here they are on the attack. Puts the puck on net. Denied by the goaltender. Find some space in the corner. District 5's got a hold of it along the wall. Here they come on the attack. What a steal in his own end. Takes the feed. He's got a step. Scores! Wow, what a goal! Nice hands, great finish. Little short break in, in the net. Wow, he rifled that past the goaltender. He had such good speed, the goalie's backing up quickly, but he can't get to the spot where the puck is. The Canucks have finally ended the scoreless tie here in the second. There was an inevitability to this. 
they've played well. They've had most of the shots. Finally, they get on the board. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Here's a chance right in the slot, and he comes up with it. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. Drives it to the front of the net. Edmonton's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Along the half wall with the puck. Gets in front of him. And he elects to play the puck. Carries it in. Moves the puck along the half wall. Here he is, Whoa. wrists it on net. He scores! Well, I like the way they stayed aggressive here, James. After scoring once, they didn't just settle the game down. They went after it again. Chilliwack's dominated in the shot department, and now they're starting to dominate in the goal department as well. This is wearing a team down. You start getting lots of shots, you spend lots of... Referee stops the play. We've got a penalty shot on the way. And here we go. Makes the stop under pressure. The shooter's looking for a hole. There is none there. The goalie was all over it. Chilliwack's done a nice job of generating pucks on net, and as a result, they lead here in the second. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And that's blocked away. Grabs the puck. And that one's picked off. Lugs the puck back into the neutral zone. Here's a chance right in front. And a smart heads up read to come up with the puck. Pumped away from danger. Stopped with ease. Handles the pass from his goalie. Carries it across the line. Gets the puck back onto a stick. Puts it on net. Scores! This is a perfectly timed shot. As soon as the goalie drops into the butterfly, this puck is delivered right over his catching glove into the top of the net. District 5's got new life here in this second period, Ray. It's amazing what a goal does. The energy on the bench changes. Guys can't wait to get on for their next shift. Sends a pass over. Move to the middle. Here's a shot. Nothing doing. Hit the net. No. He scores. Deuce is wild for him now. Well, that makes your night. I'll tell you, it's great to score one. You get a second one. It's such a rush. Thinking had he yet? Oh, he should be. I mean, he's got two in the bag already. I'll tell you one guy that would be thinking had he. Me. Well, this is like a practice drill here, James. He's so open at the high slot. The pass is on the shooting spot and he just hammers it home the Canucks have to be feeling good about themselves right now Ray a two goal cushion as they're approaching the intermission here they played well and they deserve to be in the lead that they're in now as you get close to the intermission the coach will remind them don't fall asleep yet from in close wide of the net Chilliwax got the puck along the boards Takes it across the blue line. Takes the puck at the point. Pass right in front, and that goes wide. He's got to do something a little better than that. Just can't finish it from there. Wonder if that gives him a nightmare later. And they'll be forced to regroup after the puck bounces out of the offensive zone. And great hustle to come up with the puck. Shot denied by the blocker. Like that save as he was able to deflect it to the corner. And that'll do it for period number two. Still 20 minutes more to go, unless overtime says otherwise, it's 3-1.
The third period is just moments away, and both Ray and I will be ready to bring you all the action here on EA Sports. Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. Moment of truth for one team. Here we go. Third period is underway. 40 minutes into this one here. Razor, how do you see things? Edmonton's had such a meager total. No one back. A 2-1-0. Murphy's got it in the offensive zone and can't convert. James, he's so close to making a change in this game, but he doesn't get the shot off. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Crowd's been into this one right from the get-go. It's 3-1. Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. The Canucks gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Moves the puck inside the offensive zone. Edmonton's got a hold of it against the wall. Handles the puck. Murphy's got it into offensive territory. Here's a... He scores! That's the hat trick! Oh, what a great feeling to get three goals in a game. Doing it on the road is a, is a real nice trick. That's a good feeling for the shooter. He gets out in the clear on the breakaway, and he doesn't miss. Excellent snapshot past the goalie. Chilliwack's all too aware there's no mercy rule in hockey. They continue to apply the pressure. No, they're laying a beating on these guys now. It may be time to lay back just a bit. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. Here's a chance out front! Can't get it to go. On the attack along the boards. Takes a bump and loses control of the puck. On fire! Sometimes it's just your night. You shoot the puck, it goes in the net. He's had an unbelievable evening. Once he gets in nose-to-nose -nose with the goaltender, you're always trying to sell the shot. If you're going to deke it, he goes to the forehand and puts it away. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. And gets it in deep in the opposite corner. Murphy's taking it from his own end. And that's just out of reach. The Canucks gain control of the puck against the wall. McPherson's got it across the line. Long reach breaks up the momentum. It's a two-on-one. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play if you're not sure what's going on. Freeze the puck. Chilliwack showing no signs of slowing down here in this third period up big time. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Intercepted. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Grabs the puck in the defensive zone. District 5's got the puck in their own end. Takes the pass. Let's the wrister fly. Comes up with the stop. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. And he easily stops that one. Chilliwack's offense has been the story tonight, leading big time here in this third period. Dowling's won it off the faceoff. And that's picked off in front. Up along the wing. Passes right to the front. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. The Canucks scoop it up along the boards. Pass right on the doorstep. Denies him. Great reflexes. Another save. And the puck's kicked free. Chilliwack's gained possession along the boards. 
slides the puck near the front of the net. Here's a chance behind the net. Well, I like this, James. They've really cycled the puck well on this shift. Now they can hold it, and you put the pressure on the defenders. Eventually, they pull you down, or you get a great chance. Chilliwack's got the puck along the wall. Let's it go. Denies him on the play. Trying to make something happen from behind the net. 57 seconds left. This one-sided affair finally nearing the end. Here's a shot, and that one stopped. Over the line they come. With some momentum driving towards the net, he scores! There's another! Well, they could have used this a lot earlier, man. This has just been a rotten night of hockey for them. Well, if he was about four inches taller, maybe he would have got to that. Desperation effort, but no goal. Edmonton's got to be thinking more and more offense here now in the third. No reason to sit back. You're in a hole here. You need goals and you need lots of them. Attack. Face off here in the neutral zone and we are back underway. Look out, a two-on-one. Lets it fly and makes the save. Right in the open ice, that one's picked off. From the point, looks to make something happen. Oh, and comes up with nothing on the play. You can go games without a chance from here. And he'll get a chance with a penalty shot. He takes a deep breath at center ice. It's go time here. Big save and breathe a sigh of relief. Man, he's so composed in there, doesn't look under stress at all, and makes a really straightforward save. The Canucks are in the home stretch of this one, leading big time in the third. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. With possession along the wall. District 5's got a hold of it along the wall. From the right side and up the middle. Here he is in the open ice on the breakaway! Chilliwack's up big time here in the late stages of this third period. And we are all over with this one tonight. Gray, more shots, more offense, and they converted. It dominated the game start to finish. You got a feel for the losing goaltender. He had to feel like he was at the end of a firing squad there. In the meantime and in between time, he's Ray, I'm James, good night.